look at how the studio has transformed. Great. Because right now we're talking with a former astronaut who's out of this world adventures are becoming lessons we can all use right here on Earth. Mike Massimino, he wrote Moonshot, a NASA astronaut's guide to achieving the impossible. And here to tell us more about it is Mike Massimino. Good morning. So good, good morning. To see you. Great, great to see you. Thank you for having me. So Moonshot, obviously yeah. we're talking about a spacecraft going to the moon, but also yeah. it means long shot. Yep. What does it mean to you? Well, or you know, for me, uh, it's about uh, achieving your own personal dream, your own personal moonshot. I was a skinny, scrawny kid, grew up in a working class neighborhood, uh, afraid of heights. I still don't like heights, Gio. Couldn't see very well. My eyesight went bad at wait, an wait, early wait, wait, age. Wait. You don't like heights? I don't like heights. After being in space? Space is different. As long as I'm moving, I'm okay. But I don't like, <laughs> uh, I don't like heights. So, yeah, I'm not probably the person you would think that would grow up to be an astronaut. But I was able to to apply successfully to NASA and go through the training and fly successfully in space. And if I can do it, so can you, is the, is the message there. One out of a million is not zero. It, the odds may be against you, but as long as you try, there's always a chance. And I know that you want other people in life to take moonshots yeah. themselves. How do you do that? What's the best way to do it? Well, my, what, what happened to me was I arrived at NASA and I learned so many things in uh, persistence and teamwork and leadership. And what I found was, is they were important for me to be successful working on the Hubble Space Telescope, but they're also important for what we do every day. Whether you're working in a cubicle, or you're working at home, or you're dealing with your family, the same rules apply. I mean, things that I learned, like uh, the 30-second rule, was something I learned as an astronaut. When you make a mistake, you have to move on. But I, was, I always had trouble doing that. But give yourself 30 seconds of regret, beat yourself up for 30 seconds, it's an internal timer, and then after that 30 seconds, flush it. It's time to move on. Learning from your mistakes, but not ruminating over them. Well, what, what do you think is the biggest lesson that you learned as a NASA astronaut? I think uh, in addition to dealing with mistakes, uh, it was teamwork and uh, setting up a community that you're working in with the, with the theme there. The, the takeaway there is uh, you have to find a way to care for and admire everyone on your team. And if you find someone that you might not be getting along with, don't think of it as you don't like them. Think of it as you don't know them well enough. Find that good thought on everybody in your life. And it also goes for your personal life, folks, around Christmas yep. time, dealing yep. with the family. What I say is have that good thought of something that's happened in the past. Put that in your bank of good thoughts. So when you might have a conflict, revert to that bank of good thoughts. Remember what that person means to you and how valuable they are to your team or your family or to you and move forward with that, so. You made some history back in 2009, yeah. and I wanna show this because this is the first tweet from space, okay? And you said, oh, from wow. orbit, Historic. launch was awesome, yeah. I'm feeling great, working hard, enjoying the magnificent views, yeah. the adventure of a lifetime has begun. You got some advice from Neil Armstrong. Yeah, I did, when I was, a, my, he was my, my hero, I'm old enough to remember him on the moon, I was six years old, I met him my very first week as an astronaut, I met my hero. And I asked him, how did you come up with that thing you said on the moon? You know, did your wife tell you to say that? What happened? He said, no, I didn't think about it until after I landed on the moon, Mike. And he said, you can't be thinking about that stuff. You've got to take care of your job first. So I didn't think much about what I was going to tweet on this first tweet. So I, as I was looking at the computer, trying to figure out what to tweet, I realized that was bad advice I got from my hero. I couldn't think of a thing. <laughs> and I wanted to say, you know, I wanted to say, curse you, Neil Armstrong, but I, that wouldn't go over well. So I came up with that, and then I got made fun of on Saturday Night Live, comparing oh. it to what... But with the good thing about that is my kids thought it was funny and everyone, they were and in middle school. And it is a great I got a lot of street cred out of that one. Thank you so All much. Right, you did it. You Appreciate bet. it. Moonshot goes on sale on Tuesday. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.